another recipe for you here from Shepherd Song Farm. Today I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite ways to cook potatoes. It's with rendered lamb tallow or goat tallow. And this is a delicious way to cook potatoes. The only thing that you really need to know is that you need to pre-cook your potatoes before you cook them in the pan to get them nice and crispy. So here I'm putting them in a pan to steam them, but you could also use old baked potatoes or you could boil your potatoes, but if I boil them, I make sure to leave the skin on. You'll see these have the skin on too, because it helps them not soak up too much water. And if the potatoes soak up water, they're not gonna get as crispy when you cook them in the pan. So the first step is just to peel them. You're probably gonna wanna use a paring knife like I'm using here instead of a vegetable peeler, because the vegetable peeler might get stuck on the skin a little bit and just peel the potatoes up and then cut them into kind of bite-sized pieces there. Kind of quarter them and then about one inch length, half an inch width is good. Just big enough so that they're bite-sized pieces. And from there, you get your lamb tallow. Cut the tallow up into chunks get it hot in a pan. I like a cast iron skillet. Uh, the heavier your skillet is, the crispier your potatoes will be here. So get your skillet nice and hot. Add your potatoes. And you're going to season them up a little bit, a little pinch of salt. Get the pan nice and hot. Then I'll give them a little toss just to coat them with the fat. And then I'm gonna put them in the oven. Nice hot oven, about 400 Fahrenheit. You could go a little hotter if you need. In the meantime, I like to make something called Persiad. It's finely chopped garlic and parsley. Just to finish them, I'm gonna take a clove of garlic and I'm gonna mash it, chop it with a little bit of salt, kind of acts as an abrasive. And then I'm gonna add some parsley. This will make a little bit more than you need, but you can make small amounts too. And just chop everything together on the cutting board. This is a really classic French preparation for using garlic and parsley for finishing all kinds of things. It's great tossed with roasted chicken, mushrooms, but especially crispy potatoes, maybe traditionally cooked in duck fat, but lamb fat, I gotta tell you, is probably even better. When the potatoes are hot out of the oven, put them back on the heat to get them extra crispy just for a minute or two. Then you just toss in a little spoonful of the persiade, the garlic and parsley, and maybe a little bit more if you need. And that's pretty much it. This is one of the best side dishes for people that love potatoes. I mean, everyone loves potatoes. But to sweeten the deal, maybe you don't have a cast iron skillet, so I'm gonna show you option number two is to roast them. So to do that, you're gonna take your par-cooked potatoes, fully cooked, technically. I like to add a little bit of rosemary, a little salt. I'll crush a couple garlic cloves and toss them in. And then the big difference here is I'm just gonna pour the fat on them, stir them up, and then put them onto a baking sheet. I'll make sure they're kind of spread out so they can get nice and golden brown. Roast them in a hot oven until they look like that. And that is how you make roasted potatoes with lamb fat. They're delicious. More recipes and the delicious lamb, go to shepherdsongfarm.com. I'm Chef Alan Burgo, your narrator. Thank you for watching.